Hello everybody and welcome to Eat Right with Chef Alfredo. Today I am once again joined by the lovely Michaela. Welcome Michaela. Thank you for having me. You are most welcome. Now Michaela is just back from the United States where she went to Colorado. Was there anything good that you did over there? Yes, we went alpine sliding. Alpine? What is alpine sliding? It's when you slide down a hill in a cart and it's really fun. Wait, this sounds very dangerous. It's kind of dangerous. <laughs> kind of dangerous, but yeah. also kind of fun. Now, Michaela's adventure has inspired me to make a picnic sandwich, which is why today we're making a ham and cheese toasted sandwich with tomato. Shall we get started? We shall. Now, first things first, we need to butter some bread. Now, remember to use whole grain brown bread. We're going to be making for four people, so you will need eight slices. You will need to butter both sides of the bread lightly with natural butter. Do not choose margarine. Margarine is horrible for you. Now we're using an Electa sandwich maker to make the bread nice and tasty. The great thing about this one as well is it has four spaces for four sandwiches. What's next, chef? Next, we're going to put on the turkey ham. Okay. One slice per sandwich. One, two, you can hear it cooking already, three, and four. When you are buying your turkey ham, make sure the turkeys are free range for an absolutely fresh taste. Next is the cheese. Again, one slice per sandwich. When you're using the cheese, remember to be nice and quick so you get it on the bread before it starts melting. And last but not least... The tomato. Brilliento! Again, one slice per sandwich. And then we top it off with the second piece of bread. Again, we're going to butter both sides lightly. Fantastic. Now we can close the lid. You can hear it sizzling. Yes, you can. So how long do we keep these sandwiches in? We're going to keep them in the sandwich maker for about two to three minutes until the bread is nice and golden. I can hear it sizzling away. I think it's ready to take them out. Ooh, they look amazing. Bellissimo. Be careful, it's nice and hot. When you cut it and you hear that lovely crunch, then you know it is ready. Now that we've taken out our sandwiches, for safety we can close the lid and switch off the sandwich maker. Now for the best part, the taste test. Mmm, that is really good. Bellissimo. Thank you so much, Michaela, for helping me make this delicious, tasty ham and cheese sandwich. And thank you all for watching Eat Right with Chef Alfredo. And remember, Chef Alfredo loves you. Love, love, love. Mwah.